there's no harm in taking a break. So definitely don't be too hard on yourself. And uh, I, I fall victim to that too. So yeah, take a break. You, you deserve it. So no problem, thank you. producing and stuff, I do want to be more on the behind the scenes too as well. I, I kind of find ha like a challenge and um, it motivates me a lot and you also, because every aspect of my hobby like flows in with my job. So I don't know, hopefully just do everything. I think pretty much what I'm doing now, basically going crazy and just like, doing things last minute and <laughs> procrastinating. But uh, hopefully married. I think that's the biggest change that I hope to see happen in 10 years. Aww. Will you guys be happy if I get married? Yes! Yeah. 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 Do yeah. it! I will get married. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so uh, I'll probably keep the dating DL, but then, because I just want to make sure that if whoever I marry is the person I want to marry, and I don't want to be all like, I'm dating someone that we break up, and then me. <laughs> you know? But yeah, thank you for that question. Thank you. What? Thank you. We're happy if you're happy. Hi, Trula. <laughs> Hello. Hi. Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Um, you talked about the music you like, but are there any like rappers that inspire you specifically? I just like Linkin Park. I'm, yeah. I don't know if people consider that. I, I don't know if people really consider that rap, but that's rap to me. Um, <laughs> I listen to Mike Shinoda like up the butt. I, I love him. Four minor stuff is sorry, like the album of my whole middle school. And uh, I know I'm a middle school fan. I was that young. But uh, recently, I, I actually haven't been listening to rap a lot these days. But like Chance, the rapper, he's great. Listen to Kendrick. Um, yes. I, but I'm not like a. I, I don't. I don't consider myself a fan because I don't listen to music enough. And, talk and stuff. Yeah. Who I fell upon recently. <laughs> Sorry, my manager knows him. So, yeah. Thank you. I'm gonna forget English, but I'm just trying to get this out of the way. Okay, so, um, I know you've written many songs, mm -hmm. and to, I consider that a piece of art. I honestly Thank love you. that. But what has been the song that you are the most proud of, that you Uh, I think the song I'm most proud of is probably Beautiful. Um, I have an English version. I just need to release it. <laughs> but, um, that song was, I think, my kind of, I guess, epiphany for, I guess, what, what I'm doing today. So, yeah, I think that was the starting point of like when I was like, you know what, I'm just gonna do what I need to do and what I want to do, and I'm gonna figure out how to do that. So. Um, yeah, and the message in that song for those who don't know Korean or haven't heard it is you guys are beautiful the way you are and don't let anybody change you and uh, just love yourself. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Love you too. <laughs> so much love in this room. I like it. Love you guys. Are there people? Sorry. Are there any people that like get weirded out when people say like I love you? No. Who said yes? Who said yes? Yes. Well, I love you and I love you. <laughs> I love all you guys. Sorry, go ahead. <laughs> yeah. Um, oh my god, my palms are sweating. I think you like infected all of us with like the word thing. Like my brain's clogged out a little bit too early. But um, okay. For me, I really love fashion and I really love appearances. And in a lot of the things you talked about, appearances is one of them. Like androgyny with women. And for me, it was very inspirational to me. But uh, for the question, what is one of your favorite looks that you or maybe one of your other members have um, served? <laughs> 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 In any video or comeback or stage? 
Uh, or is it, um, do you, are you asking more or less in general, like my life, or just only in work? Uh, in, the, in, the, in the work sense, I guess we'll I guess in the work sense. Work sense? Um, huh. Hmm. I was actually very against the four walls concept, that whole like retro thing. Just wait, wait, hear me out, 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 okay, okay. Because when they first gave it to us, I was like, I cannot pull this off. Like, uh, uh. But uh, I think after they like put us in the outfits there, because the music video was very different from our actual performances because there was no choreography in the actual music video. I didn't really get a sense of what they were going for um, until we were put in the stage office. So I guess Four Walls is probably my, my favorite because it's like a little homage to like the, sorry, I'm wrong, the 80s, 70s, I don't, 90s, I'll just throw a ring out there. 75. <laughs> right, be right in the middle, but yeah, I think Four Walls and, uh, um, you know, Lacha Tsa, it was a lot of like, you know, uh, all that, like the flannels, like you can't, you can't go wrong with flannels. Yeah. So, yes. Thank you. Thank you. Hi. I'm sorry. Okay. Yeah. Um, I was wondering, um, what is the most difficult part about you know cre creating, producing your own music? Hmm. Because like I came out with yeah. my own singles and stuff like yeah. two years ago. And before that, you know, I feel like the K-pop industry is kind of a little more confined than that. Yeah. So. I was actually going to get to that. <laughs> Thank you for half answering my question. Um, I, I think the hardest part actually, just to be, again, really real with you guys, it wasn't the creating part, it was actually, um, I, I felt like what I was as a solo artist was very different from what people were very used to, so actually convincing people um, and explaining what I was trying to do I think was the hardest part. and. Uh, it's slowly getting there, so you know that's why I have a lot of stuff in the in the vault ready to be shot out at any moment. So, yeah, I think that was probably the most difficult part because I did start at a really young age, and um, you know, it, again, it has been ten years, and I, I am only twenty five right now. So, people can still view me as you know, like the little little Amber that came in when she was fifteen. So, yeah, that was the hardest part. Thank you. Thank you. All right, so Valley Girl to Valley Girl. Um, I noticed that you signed your name with the uh, Philippians yeah. uh, 413. Mm -hmm. Why that specific Bible verse? Like, well, what meaning does that one have for you? Uh, so Philippians 413 says, um, I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. And I, f I think when, amen. 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 <laughs> <laughs> uh, I was bullied a lot in school and um, I think, I felt like I could never do anything. And I felt very weak and very powerless. And you know, I think that's why I kind of very much geared toward more masculine, quote unquote, uh, quote -unquote masculine activities, like sports and all that, because I just didn't want to be, um, you know, helpless, I guess, if you want, if I could say it like that. So, um, you know, and definitely like, uh, when I go to church and, um, you know, just talk about, God and everything, it just kind of gives me strength, and you know, he's just been that, that, that guy, he's not a good old God, he's just been <laughs> there for me a lot, so, you know, I really hold on to that, because, you know, I don't feel alone when I, when I think about that verse, so that's what helps me. Alright, thank you. Thank you. We can go for more, I'm okay. Good Ruby, oh yeah, I'm okay, sorry guys. <laughs> so, yeah, that concludes our student Q&A portion of the night. Um, <laughs> and also, just a quick announcement. If you did win the meet and greet wristband, uh, we'll have you line up uh, to my right side in the back. And don't forget to follow us on social media for upcoming events. It's ASPD underscore UCR. And you can follow us on our website, ASPD.UCR.edu. Uh, we had such a great time with you. We hope you did too. Get home safe. Thank you, guys. Never don't leave! No! Hopefully you guys weren't too, like, too bored. Wait, are you guys, like, identical twins? Are you guys identical twins or, like, paternal? Are you guys no, not even twins? I'm older. By three years. Shit! Oh, shit! Yeah.
Hands down, the creator of the GIF said it was Jeff. So, yes. Bye, guys. Thank you. Go safe. Wear your seatbelts. Make good choices. Don't talk to strangers. If you, have, if you talk to strangers, be nice to them. Yes. Bye, guys. Love yourselves, you guys. Love yourselves. Love people. And uh, you guys are beautiful. Love you guys. Bye. Sibling, use them. <laughs> Not my turn. Bye, guys.